Hi y'all. Just a little tip on motor carrier, I mean not motor carrier, on carrier packets. When I started, when I was booking loads from the load board, I would go through the load board and whatever carriers were on there, I would complete as many carrier packages as I could. Because that way, when I called the broker to book the load, I wasn't wasting time completing carrier packets. So literally what I would do is in my downtime, I would get on the load board and whatever carriers came up, I would check to see if they were approved by my bro by my um, factoring company. And if they were approved, I went ahead and did the, pa the, did the carrier packet. So all you're gonna do is if it's Landstar, you Google Landstar carrier packet, pull it up, fill it out. If you can't fill it out, it'll tell you if you have to wait until you have 30, 60, 90 days or whatever, it'll tell you that. Then you just make a spreadsheet of all the ones that's 30 days, the ones that's 60 days, the ones that's 90 days, and the ones that you've completed. Of the ones that you've completed, now you have a list of carrier packets that you've already completed. So when you're looking for a load, you can focus on those because you've already completed the carrier packet and you're not wasting time on the others because you already know they're not gonna sign you on because you don't have enough time under your belt with your authority. It just makes it a lot easier. So just take a Saturday. I did. I think I did it over the course of like a month. Um, it maybe wasn't a month, it was like two weeks. And just go through the load board and everyone that comes up that is okay to factor, complete the carrier packet. And once you do like two or three carrier packets, all the information is the same and you're just hitting the button, bing, 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 and you're done. Um, there's also an app, I think it's called Go Highway, that has um, uh, brokers on there that you can complete a lot of carrier packets all at one time. But again, make yourself a list of all the ones that you've completed the ones that's 30 days, 60 days, 90 day approval, put those in the columns. And so that way you can make yourself a little um, ticker on your calendar to go back at 30 days and go ahead and, and um, do those carrier packets or whatever. So that's what I did. It makes it a lot easier when you're trying to book a load um, because again, time is of the essence when you're trying to book a load because the broker next to the broker that you're speaking to is trying to book the same load. So you don't wanna waste a lot of time. So I hope that helps.